I didn't hear. Oh, man, we got to fix that, guys. Our good man, Dots Kill, in the house. Ladies and gentlemen, are you ready to get rowdy? He's a flag of the first one. Super! And all around cool. And promises superior performance over longer periods of time. Please welcome Dots Kill. Oh, I'd love to. Wow, that's cool. Very cool. Yeah. Boom! Come on, survive, survive, Pete. Come on, Petey, stay alive. Stay alive. There you go. Woo! Boy, that damage. Those cosmic damage, though. Oh, that's cool, Ghost Child. Good for you. That's great. I think it's a wonderful thing. I think everybody who likes to socialize and have friends, um, I think it's great. Uh, to get out there and stream. It's a great way to meet people, have, have fun, build a social community that you can hang out with. Really, really rewarding. Oh, nobody guessed, guys. All right, we got to go. You know what that means? Nobody guessed. So that means we move up. Time to move it up. Are you guys ready? All right. Now, 100. Let's do uh, 100 weirdos now, guys. Again. Good luck. Guess number between 1 and 10. How am I doing uh, 100? Um, uh, eight, 2 million damage. So, Ordinatus, it's a lot like any other kind of uh, MMOs or ARPG games. You see it in... Um, I don't know if you ever played Diablo 3, if you play Path of Exile, if you play any of those kind of games. There is a scale. There is it, Eventually, the damage is going to scale up, right? Um... Your damage is going to scale up because the NPC's health scales up. It's just the way developers work it. They, they scale you up so high, but your own health doesn't really scale up that much. It's just the way they, they scale they uh, scale these kind of games. Um, um, as far as I know, that's the way most games are, you know? Uh, EverQuest, my warrior has, you know... My warrior has 35,000 damage, but I can do abilities that do like 500,000 damage, you know? Um, you know, Diablo 3, I can do like 15, 20 million, but my barbarian only has like 35,000 health, health. It's just, it's just, you know, and I don't know why um, that's the particular way they do it. Yeah, 10 is possible, dot scale, 10 is possible. But that's just kind of the way of the world in video games, uh, it seems like. All right, so we're moving along here. Let's get all this, and I'm looking for. There we go, over that way. Can we get through here? No, we can't. You are not one of no, us. No, I'm not one of you. Definitely not. Come on, you little scallywags. What do you got over here? There we go. There's our guy. There he is. Let's do a little amazing smash. Now we're cooking with them hot greases. Oh my goodness. Did somebody win? Is it over? Nope, it's zero. Wait, Ordinatus got it. Congratulations, Ordinatus. There you go, buddy. Ordinatus got it. Nicely done, sir. Nicely done. Um... Weirdos is the stream currency ordinatus. We do giveaways from time to time in this channel. Last night we gave away a copy of Wow of um of The Witcher 3. Um, we've given away other games. We give away a game of Fallout 4 whenever Fallout 4 was first released. We just give away games from time to time. It's something we like to do to, to reward you guys for hanging out. And the way you get into the giveaways is by buying raffle tickets with your weirdos. You use the stream currency and you buy raffle tickets, and the more raffle tickets you have, the better chance you have of winning. So. Nice! Ah, oh, yeah, there you go, Ordinatus. Congratulations, man. That's good stuff, buddy. That is good stuff. I wonder if I have to still go clear out more of the... Uh... There we go. That's it. We're done. Good. Good. Chair is like Santa. <laughs> hey, that's the pot calling the kettle black right there, guys. Geeky Barista, man, he gives away a lot of games too. That dude has that dude has a crazy time in his stream. 
And he actually knows how to have fun, unlike Jeremy Fu. This weirdo who doesn't even drink. Geeky has a blast in his stream, man. If you guys don't know Geeky, you gotta check him out. The guy is amazing. Sir! Sir! Stay with it. Don't die, Peter! Don't die! Oh my goodness, that could have been bad. So what are we trying to do in this one? Let me see. Gotta go down, Jaron. This one time. Yep. All right, Ghost Child. Have a great day. Always good to see you. And uh, good luck with you with everything going on in your life right now. Uh, hang in there, ma'am. And uh, hey, good luck with the streaming. You know that's great. That's great that you're streaming. There we go. Thanks. I'm here all week. Thanks. I'm here all week. You tell him, Spidey. Hey, you know, I need to see what I'm supposed to actually be doing for here. Eliminate the mutate chief. Okay, good. That we can do. He's over here. No, I know. Yeah. I'm just mostly geeky. I'm just picking on my on myself. I'm picking on myself because uh, I am kind of a stick in the mud because I don't drink. That's all. The there you go. There we go. Let's get there. We go. So Let this this thing right here, guys, that this Eternity Splinter. Oh yeah, fanatics, the hype is real. Give it up for our newest. Oh member. my goodness, Squirrel Joe! Thank you for that follow, Squirrel Joe. High five! You are the newest fanatical wizard of the 268th order. Welcome to the family, my friend. Um. Those Jer buttons. <laughs> Shell Rain. You don't push my buttons, Shell Rain. You don't push my buttons, buddy. Uh, all right, we got a turning this over here. But uh, yeah, so. Yeah, somebody broke something. Angry Orchard. I love me some Angry Orchard. Angry Orchard is so good. This looks bad. So the the things on the ground, yeah, those are in this particular instance, uh, Ordinatus. These maps have different uh, effects. This particular instance has AOEs. Those are AOEs that are being put on by this mob. And if I land in them, they will hurt me big time. And that's probably what killed me, to be honest. There we go. Just pop into the shops. All right, Dark Dice. Good stuff, man. But, uh, yep. What is good, Squirrel Joe? How are you doing today, buddy? Let's get rid of that. There we go. I shouldn't even be worried about these these single mobs. Yeah, no problem, Ordatus. Now, like these right here, buddy. Okay, do you see this over here where it says utility, damage, amplification? These particular spots right here, what that means, I think. Now, this is all new. These This particular game mode is new. If I'm in these areas, it will amplify all damage I do and possibly all the damage that I take as well. So, it's just an interesting little addition to the game for these game modes. Oh, man. There you go. There you go, Dark Daz. Good stuff, man. Uh, let's go over here. Digital Wolf, my boy. What is up, sir? How are you doing today? Sir, sir, get off me. Sir, I'm doing great, Digital Wolf. Having a good time, man. I was pretty excited. Marvel Heroes came out with a big patch that, that modified the game, the in-game group stuff, or uh, single-player stuff significantly. Um, I don't know if Digital Wolf, if you've ever played, like, Diablo 3, Path of Exile, games like that. Well, in Path of Exile, you have in-game maps, right? In Diablo 3, you have rifts. Well, they added the danger room, the danger room, which is a similar style. They dropped these danger room maps that you can enter, and they have randomized affixes, and you can go in and finish them and get rewards for doing them. So it's pretty cool. Not the beaver pit. Sorry, Frecky. Rest in peace, sir. There we go. It's Done with all that. In the reflexes. All in the reflexes. We are superior. And we're almost ready. You see the progress bar up here. We're almost done with it. 
There we go. Da did I say danger zone? I'm sorry. Danger room. Danger zone. Yeah, right. This is not 1985, and it's not uh, Top Gun. This is not Kenny Kenny uh, Loggins. <laughs> right? Thank you, thank you for catching that for me, Geeky. <laughs> there we go. Oh, let's get this, guys. Big old group right here. This will fix it. This will take care of it. Goodbye, bye. Objective complete. Objective complete, folks. Fly into the. <laughs> oh man. Fly into the danger. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got, 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 got. Saber tooth. So, uh, I'm getting a naval cutlass for my Christmas. I'm already wondering about the fun of defending my from home invasion with it while wearing my tricorn hat. That sounds like cool stuff, man. Ordinatus, man. You have got to send. Okay, Ordinatus. That sounds awesome. When you get it, can you take a picture and show us? Hey, Brad Vickers, how are you doing? Brad Vickers, hi, and good night to you, my friend. Hope you're having an amazing day. All right. Was born in 85. You were born in 85. Were you geeky? Nice. Uh, let's go take on Sabretooth. Sabretooth. Here you go, sir. Must be my lucky day. Must be my lucky day. Jester, what's up, sir? And remember, I already died twice, guys, so I gotta be real careful here. As a matter of fact, you know what? Ultimate time. Bye bye. Bye bye, Sabertooth. Eliminated. Boom! He got shredded. Get wrecked, Sabertooth. Oh my goodness, did you guys hear that? Did you guys hear that? Jester said we're gonna do a guessing game question. And the winner. The winner is going to win a free beta key <clears throat> for the new up-and-coming game, Bra um, Paladins Beta. Paladins Beta. So, how about it? Jester, go ahead and give me the question. <clears throat> Let me put it on full camera for just a minute so you guys don't see the answer. Uh, interaction... Okay, pull this over here. All right. Uh, yeah, Jester, let me know whenever you're ready, bud. <clears throat> All right. And you know what else we got to do? There we go. There we go. Put that over there. Good. And let's go see what kind of rewards we got. So we are sitting at 310 merits, guys. Let's see what we get. Boom. Ending simulation. Ending simulation. 30, 20, not bad. Unique. I gotta get some pockets in this suit. True story, Pete. True story. A blue danger room, a unique, and 10. A green danger room, and that puts us at three. So we got 60. We got 60. That's not bad. Not bad. And we've been getting some pretty good Omega points, too. Where are we at on our Omega points? 79. I've got to get to uh, 200 to train in my next rank of fighting. Okay, so that's going to be a while to get that. Not bad, guys. Not bad. All right. Oh, wow. We got two of the same uniques. Spider armor boots. Now, let me see. Yeah, absolutely, Shell Rain. Sounds good, buddy. I appreciate that. Uh, with the colors, what's the highest rarity? Okay, yeah, sure. Um, so, and this goes for gear, Ordinatus. Gear, weapons. It also goes for these danger room maps. Um, as far as I know, the danger room maps work the same way. There's white going and in increasing. There's white, green, blue. Well, I can look at it right there. White, green, blue, purple, yellow, and uh, beige. So you got uh, uncommon, common, Rare, uh, epic, cosmic, and and unique. I put it in admin chat. Okay, cool. Yep. So let's check it out. I mean, let me do this question real quick. Um, admin. Let's see. Okay. Oh, man. 
Yep, Jester, we can go with that. We can go with that. Uh, that's not too difficult. People should be able to know that one. Pretty easy, right? So, um, I'm going to have to... The thing about this one is I'm going to have to worry about spelling. I mean, it's easy to spell, but... But I want to make sure that... Uh, yeah. Bum, 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 Okay, so, um, and we're not gonna, um, do you want to also award some weirdos for this? Or no? It's up to you, um, actually, yeah, why not? Let's go ahead and award 50 weirdos as well to the winner, right? Um, well, now, yeah. It's going to be first correct spots, guys. This is going to have to be first correct spots because we can't have multiple winners, obviously. So, let's do this. Um, okay. So, we'll do this. I don't think case sensitivity is a, is a thing. Yes, give it to me, Changa, right? There you go. Uh, first correct response. Make sure I get everything right on here. Save it. All right, are you guys ready? Again. Here we go, guys. This is what we're going to do. We are going to do a question. And the first correct response will win a key, a beta key for the Emoba Paladins from Jester. Okay? So let's do it. Stream interaction. Good luck, guys. Good luck. And there is your question, right there. I'm not going to read it out loud because of delay. First person gets it. It's not that hard either. It's not that hard. Sumat Kirby. <laughs> nope, 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 nope. That is a actual, a, um... Stanley, it's Stanley and well, Steve Ditko was the artist. Steve Ditko was the artist. Oh, I shouldn't be saying this. Y'all should be putting your uh, things in. But we've got a correct answer already, I think. Yep. Mods are out. Yeah, mods can't do it. Bump, bump, bump. <laughs> Naughty. <laughs> I shouldn't have been saying anything. Shouldn't have been saying anything. Well, the artists are important. Don't get me wrong. Steve Ditko played a big role. And um, Johnny Clutch says Tom DeFalco. Irk Thomas. What's up, Irk Thomas? Jack Kirby. It's an interesting, interesting story. Uh, let's see. The Google going. <laughs> it should be over right now. How come it's... I guess maybe I made two minutes too long. Two minutes is too long, but that's okay. Well, this is a... This is one of those questions that could be a controversial question. And I'll explain why. Yep. Digital Wolf, congratulations. You are right. Now... Eric Thompson, that is a great point. There are there are some rumors and there are some debate as to whether Jack Kirby actually created Spider-Man. He insists he did. Um, we went with Stan Lee because that's the more traditional answer. Because he was, and I know that's a controversial topic because a lot of people do not like Stan Lee. Uh, they think he takes credit pretty much for everything Marvel, you know. But... Um, for our purposes here, the answer is going to be Stan Lee. Congratulations. Congratulations there, Digital Wolf. You won. All right. Now, um, let me go put this stuff up. And, yeah, see, I don't think this is going to be an upgrade for me. Yeah, it's cameos. Those are neat. Those are neat. 
And, and it, you know, it's, it's a big controversy, too, because you see Stan Lee in everything Marvel, but let's be honest, Stan Lee didn't create everything. No. <laughs> Lazy Swayze. Lazy Swayze knows what I'm talking about. Stan Lee has his, his negative points. Trust me. He does. But the guy, the guy did a lot to put comics in general where we're at today, you know? So, yeah. But you're right. He, he's had, he's had, he has his issues. I will not lie about that. Um, I need to get rid of my uniques, my legendaries here. Put them up. Legendary. We'll put them right here. Um, now, are any of these upgrades? I'm going to know because I'd have to get another finding bonus. I can't. <sighs> right, Shell Rain? He created everything, right? <clears throat> and uh, But you know what, though, Irk Thompson? <clears throat> is, is Irk still here? Because you know what? I am impressed that somebody else knew that, that knew about that. Con that's something that's not widespread, guys. Irk Thompson... You get 50 free weirdos, my friend, for bringing that up because that is a great topic. My One of my buddies that I work with and I have that argument all the time. Not an argument, but a debate about um, Kirby and Stan Lee, you know. Pretty interesting topic. <clears throat> good stuff, good stuff. All right, so done with that. Let me go sell. Waka, waka, waka. Nice. Waka, waka, waka. Uh, none of this junk. I don't want to sell any of my... Uh, sell that. Sell that. Sell that. I don't like that these things look similar to team-up gear. It's kind of dangerous. You might actually accidentally sell them. Let's put... Uh, Spider-Man. Spot oh, man, it's full. I forgot it's full. Full. Oh, man. And I've got these extra costumes, too. Uh, okay, we can't put it there. Let's... I got so much junk in my inventory. It's not even funny, guys. It's not even funny. All right, there we go. I didn't want that there. I wanted it down here. Nonsense, I tell you, sir. Nonsense. All right. There we go. Oh yeah, fanatics, the hype is real. Give it up for our newest member. Irk Thompson, welcome Irk, a.k.a. Flash Thompson. Just kidding, just kidding. How are you doing, Irk? Thank you for that follow. Welcome to the Fanatic Zone. You are the newest Fanatical Wizard of the 268th Order. Thank you, and pull up the comfy chair. Enjoy your stay. Easy to get them confused with other things. I hope they change the color while they're on the ground. Yes, Lazy Swayze, I had that happen to me a while ago. I actually accidentally bypassed two um, of the danger room uh, scenarios because they were sitting on the ground and I didn't realize that they were. Instead of Forge, I am back with Fanatic sweats, Sweets and Shenanigans. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, what kind, Dark Daz? What kind, buddy? Inquiring minds want to know. What kind? All right, what do we want to do here? 20... 20. Bonus merits 20. Let's do this one. Let's just go ahead and get this white one out of the way. There we go. Let's go do it. Ah, uh, day 58 was latest stream day, right? Shell Rain, I remember that. That was your day, sir. Day 58 was the day. Shell Rain is a Funatical Wizard of the 58th Order. That is right. All right, let's go over here. We got several uh, turrets here we need to get rid of. There we go. Good stuff. We got another one there. Another one bites dust. If it ain't Swedish fist, no one cares. <laughs> What's the deal with that, Ordinatus? Is, is Swedish, is Sweden, are they known for their fish? I don't know, unfortunately. I'm not very up on international affairs. Here's another one. Good. Got that down. Where are we going? Up. Oh, we got one down here. <laughs> the site doesn't like me. Oh, it's not working on Pixie. 
That's weird. Um, that I'm not. Fish shaped gummy gummy candy. <laughs> and they, oh man, that does sound interesting. Um, yeah. Uh, I'm not sure, Pixie. I I apologize. I don't really know. I've never tried using um, one of those Visa cards or anything like that with a uh, with PayPal. So I'm not sure how it works. What was it? Or oh, probably. I wouldn't be surprised. Who knows? A Trex T Rex head. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, the bombs. Yeah. There are T Rexes in here. Yep. Uh, good old Modoc with his his experiments. Ooh, Norwegian fish pudding. I don't know if I could do fish pudding of any kind. That sounds a little. Uh... All right, here we go. See, there it is. The t Rocket Rex is what it's called, buddy. Rocket Rex. There we go. Now. Eliminate remaining forces. We can do that, right? Shut down the experiments. Shut down the experiments. Uh, Don't be weird. Uh, All right, we got to work our way down. Uh, yeah, pretty much, Ordinatus. That's what it is, man. That's all it is. All right, here we go. This should clear us out. If these guys will cooperate. Prototype test in progress. Prototype test in progress. How's that? How you like that for a prototype, sir? All right, we still need a little bit of sliver of progress bar. Good. All right. Over here, a couple of over here. Good stuff. We opened one fish pudding on accident. The room was not usable for. Oh my goodness! Really? Are you serious? It smells that bad? <clears throat> That's crazy, man. What? So what's the point of fish pudding? Is it like a? Uh, is it like some some completed. some exotic hors d'oeuvre or something? I've never even heard of that. Continue! Continue on, young man! Eliminate three elite AA AIM agents and mechs. Okay. There's one right here. And AIM improved rec bot. Again, I mentioned this earlier, but it's worth noting again. What's pretty cool is... um. I like these new mobs they added. They're orange instead of uh, with the, before you had like bosses and then you had like cosmic mobs which were, which were like champion mobs and then like blues, green, things like that. A blue pack, I mean, not greens, a blue pack. But now they added these yellow, these orange ones. I like this. It's like a mini, bo they're mini bosses basically. There we go. Get that. Time for the amazing smash. smash a -roo. Those of you that are just getting started out in the game, I will tell you, when you get to level 60 and you start farming stuff and you start seeing these com um, costume cores dropping, do not, I repeat, do not let costume cores lay on the ground. You never know where you're going to get that rare, really good costume core. And if you miss it, you may never get it. So, just a little heads up. Um, Norwegian fish stuff is weird. Oh, I gotcha. There we go. There we go. All right, we need one more of those aim bots. In the face! How about this? How about this? Come over, come over, come over. No whammy, no whammy, no whammy. There we go. There we go. A little bit of experience. We got an Omega Point. Good. Okay, on our way down. Same one as that. Yeah, good point. Lazy Swayze. Totally forgot about that. That's a point. That's a good point. Insignias, although you know what's bad. I don't really pick up Insignias unless I get uh, Epic Insignias. 
because then you can upgrade them to cosmic. But although, can you upgrade the lower ones to cosmic as well? Or does it have to be epic? I don't know. But I, sh I should pick up all of them. Hey, <laughs> you hackers. Yeah. There we go. And here is our last one up here that we need. Come on, come on, you little rocket man. Rocket man. That'll battle. There we go, there we go. Eliminate remaining foes to fill the progress bar. And we're actually almost there. Oh man, here we go. You'll pay for this. You'll pay for this. I'm sure I will, sir. I'm sure I will. Yeah, Epic Insignia is right. Okay. That's what I thought. I didn't think you could do them with the, the lower level ones. But yeah, you're absolutely right. And I, and I I would be remiss if we didn't point that out. Because uh, Insignias are so hard to get good ones. So get all the good ones you can. And get them all. Complete. And then hopefully get end up with a good one. All right. There we go. There we go. Now, who we have? Modoc. Oh, yeah. Speaking of Modoc, there he is. And I... I was wondering if we'd get Modok in his facility here. And that looks like we will. Him and his little silly teleportation nonsense. It's all in the reflexes. Uh-huh. Don't let them interfere. Don't uh. let them interfere. Uh, how did you penetrate our impenetrable security? <laughs> I love it when they say that. How did you penetrate our impenetrable security? Well, I guess it wasn't so impenetrable, was it? Come on, Modoc. Let's show you what's up. And actually, well, I got him almost down now. I was going to say we could really probably finish him Target off with the ultimate, eliminated. but he was easy. He was pretty much easy. Neat. Isotopes, isotopes, danger room scenario. Don't forget that. On we go. Head, did he, how did Modoc's head get so big anyway? Ordinatus, you know, and, and that's one of the one of the enemies I don't really um, know a lot about because Spider-Man hasn't really fought him much, hasn't really dealt with him much, if any, to be honest with you. I don't remember reading any any stories with Spider-Man and Modoc. There probably are some, but I'm not familiar with it. Um, Danger Room Merits. Stark Tech hey, Power Cube, dad. there you go. Always wanted a doodad. A doodad. Ending simulation. No, okay, I was gonna say, did I not get anything out of that box? There it is. Fantastic for this is Fantastic Four Insignia. Danger room. Alright, we're good. Yeah, his ego day yeah, wouldn't wouldn't surprise me with some of these enemies. Alright, we got the um the superior spider claws. I don't use those really for the, the build that I'm doing. The spider bots is better. What did we get on our cube, our Stark Tech? One rank to evasive web slinging, which I don't think. Which one is evasive web slinging? I can't remember. See, I don't think I use that. And web sling. Yeah, right there. I don't use it, so not even not even worth it. All right, let's put up this up oh, not what I wanted to do uh what do we get deflect and dodge rating insignia of the she hulk uh plea bargain aura when you land a brutal strike you and your allies gain 184 crit brutal and 110 physical defense yeah so not good not a good one relax, relax. just because I could build this stuff with my eyes closed doesn't mean I did well you know maybe you should Okay, now we can sell this. Modoc Medallion. I don't even know why I picked that up. And let's put that up. Spider Claws. Yep. Um, no. Let's put it here. Put it there, pal. See? All right. There we go. Okay, guys. That is going to be it. Short, sweet afternoon stream. Um, I got to go get some stuff done. Go get some shopping done myself. And get some other work done for the stream. 
So I'll be back tonight. We were, we will have our normal stream tonight, 9 p.m. Eastern. So, um, Let's see. All right. You know what? We don't get to raid Dudorino very often because most of the time Dudorino is not streaming when we get off. So you know what we're going to do tonight, guys? We are going to we are going to raid LX Dudorino. All right? Yeah, no problem, Papas. So you guys know how this works. Fnatic train. Fnatic train and bring it over to Dudorino stream. Bring him the love, bring him the hype, guys. And thank you guys for being here. Lazy Swayze, Papas, Shell Rain, Johnny Clutch, Ordinatus, Frankie, Pixie, Terra. All of you guys. Everybody have a great night. Jeremy Fuzat, I'll see you tonight at 9 p.m. Eastern. Have a great day, guys.